I'm in before that, and then like I said, tomorrow's a pretty busy day with some field trips, so we'll have some fun. <laughs> if something breaks, talk to dad. We got Jim in the house. We'll do some uh, mayhem mindset stuff throughout the weekend. You got Tyler and Bailey, newlyweds. Paige's over there. Paige Powers. You got Gee. Uh, you got Rut, the dog. You got AJ. AJ does a lot of stuff uh, working on athletes around here. So if you have anything nagging, uh, want to ask anything about imbalances or anything like that, AJ's the one to go to. Good. Bennett there with the camera. Uh, Sarge. Sarge. Yeah, there he is. He's not a creep with a phone. He actually is taking some videos. So, um, uh, if you got four-ish workouts, but more like two workouts tonight, we'll explain that in a minute. Have some fun tonight. Let us know if you have something you want a uh, scale for, or not even a scale, just an alteration um, on a workout, or you don't feel comfortable doing something. Let us know. That's what it's, that's what we're here for. Sarge, give him your spiel. Oh, uh, there's a place there called Red Silo Brewing Company. There's a guy in there that looks a lot like me. A lot. Same clothes and everything. But, but it's not him. It's not him, though. He's got a mustache, though. He's got a mustache. Yeah, what happened, what happened to your mustache? I failed. And the biggest thing is, I said it once, Rich said it as well, but it's the, the mountain bike piece with Specialized. Um, that's a new thing for us that we're doing. You guys are like the first group. That we'll have a trail them. option and yes. then a, a paved path option. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We brought e-bikes with them, too. So if you oh, are really fit and you, you don't want to do the work, then we'll put you on one of those and not tell anybody wow. else. Wow, e-bikes, nice. Um, but that's it. Like the most important thing, everybody, if you haven't been here before, you guys are going to have the jitters and the nerves going on tonight. That'll all be gone by in the morning. So just leave it here. Don't be nervous. Don't, don't let it leak have a great out. Time. Um, and so that's it. We'll, uh, cool. Yeah. Good to go. What train with Rich is this? 29. Ah, oh, almost. Will there ever be a point where you stop counting? No, never. We'll just be, we got plenty of number. We can just keep going. Train with Rich, uh, he would love it. Train with Rich a million. Is it hard to program right now with all your mountain biking training you're doing? Yes and no. I mean, today was a heavy leg day, so there's going to be a lot of upper body this afternoon. You don't want to be riding right now, right? Uh, you would have rode depends. more today. But no, I rode two hours this morning. Oh. 2 15, 2 20. Friday's a long day. All right, so it is Train with Rich, and the, the point right now. What I'm training for is 100 miles at Leadville. So this morning we rode uh, 27 miles, I think, and about 3,500 feet of climbing. So we're gonna do a little upper body. <laughs> uh, um, the way this will work, you will partner up. Josh is gonna go through that. You're gonna partner up at three, two, one, go. Partner one will go 27 ski, 27 dumbbell bench, 21, 21, 15, 15, nine, nine. So the whole workout. Partner two will go after partner one's done, their rest for their sit between their sets will be how long it takes their partner to do it. We're going to put a 20, what do we say? Let's go 30 minute time cap. Just want to make sure everybody gets a workout in. There, when it hits 30 minutes, you're going to flip flop and you're going to do the other workout. Questions? What's your question? Comments, concerns, good? Let me clean up after mine. Yeah. Awesome life. Oh, that was so sweet. Mm -hmm. Hey, it's our one week anniversary today. Wow. Yeah. So we made it. You make it one week, dude. You make it forever. Two, we, can, we can do anything at this point. Can. You guys in honeymoon? Just for games training? No honeymoon. Maybe after the games. Either beach or Europe. The, the question is, after a trip to the CrossFit Games and that much training, are we going to want to lay on the sand for a little bit? Backpack and hike around. It's <laughs> 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 oh, nothing. Stuff's missed. Yeah. Well, we had like to talk it. strategy. <laughs> yeah. We had to talk strategy before, so. Yeah. Congratulations on your one week anniversary. Thank you. Thank you. It's been awesome. <laughs> Hey, you guys the Get
We've got the most blue collar man in this building here. It doesn't. He's a desk jockey. Seems to be electrical. He's a desk jockey right now. Someone seems to have put a massive dent in it, and the blade is. How do we fix it? Hammer. Well, we just have to hammer where the blades hit. Outside of the 20 ounce, I just need a wooden block. Oh. <laughs> Definitely Dropped it really hard. Yeah, and, and that's what came in. Turns out we didn't need a hammer, I just punched it. The Roman Luke. Probably Luke, probably Roman Luke D in that order. Uh, the little feet on it, the metal feet, oh, yeah. someone had dropped it so hard on the feet that it came in. Yeah, yeah, I was just bend it out. I had to do that one bit. I got two guesses who it could be. Luke or Roman. Yeah. They beat the hand, they beat the top handles with a kettlebell. This is a key bar. So your dad had to hammer it out, take it home, and beat it with a freaking hammer and a bike. Oh, okay, Roman right. used them to beat the key bars then. When they weren't fitting. They're like they're like the cavemen. They are, dude. They're ca cavemen. Told him to do 55s and he's like, oh, 60s? 60s? All right, that's it for tonight. Uh, make sure you get plenty of food, plenty, uh, plenty to drink. It's gonna be hot, I think, tomorrow. I think it's supposed to warm back up. Humid, nasty. Like I said, it's gonna be a long day tomorrow. It will be a ton of fun, though, so looking forward to that. Uh, like I said, the, the bike thing will be a first for us. Uh, we've done the pond a couple times, and don't be super, like, don't worry about the pond. There's, literally, you can walk around the entire thing if you don't want to swim. Um, if you have some, you're gonna have a fun time, whether you like it or not. Let's say, eight, let's be ready to go about 8.30 in the morning. So if you need to get here a little early to warm up, or not warm up, mobilize, whatever you wanna do, we'll try to hit the ground running about 8.30. We'll do, we'll give you time to warm up, but anything else? Good? All right, 8.30, see you in the morning. Appreciate it, guys. This is, this is our honeymoon. I hate barbecue. I was like, did you go to your own wedding? We ate barbecue 14 times. <laughs> yeah, we did. have it. I didn't have it. Barbecue. I have pulled pork and mac and cheese. <laughs> <laughs> My dad's wedding. What's wrong with meatloaf? I didn't say anything was wrong. Fish I love. He's like, I had meatloaf. I'm Don't like, you like meatloaf? Beef, beef, beef ribs? Challenge point? Yeah, Arkansas Game Warden. How'd you get that? Gave it to me. We got a big day, so I don't want to like bury him first thing in the morning. What are you gonna do tomorrow? I don't know. Tomorrow's gonna be like lay on the floor for three hours. Yeah. This today the biggest day in the history of Paris Rip. Maybe. It's gonna be close. Yeah, it's very close. The only other time is that once we did a train with Rich in July, like right before the games, and that was basically like the games, <laughs> but we did it here. People were crawling out of here on Sunday. Or should we make this wall ball? We'll time out. One person's here, one person's here. Should be about the same time-ish. Flip-flop, flip-flop. And then... Same. Same here. Yeah. Should be close-ish, right? Bring it up! <laughs> Let's go same pairs as last night, same group of four. We'll go to opposite workouts. 10-minute AMRAP. It's good. They're going to be partners. We'll do water event. We'll lift, lunch, bikes, and then swim. So, lots of fitness today. Lots of fun. Who's your partner? I don't know. AJ? <laughs> Oh, yeah. Make Con AJ into it. Huh? I'm having PTSD flashbacks. Hey, are you are you warm? I'm having. <laughs> this is not good. You think he'd learn his lesson the first time? I said, you think you'd learn your lesson the first time? <laughs> hey, it's it. Two, one, go! Circus practice.
Little shoulder pump. Leg right. pump. Did you, did you give Tyler his demerit? Yep, demerit. What's my demerit for? AJ almost died because you weren't here this morning. He told me he's mad at us for this morning. AJ, AJ's life was on the line. <laughs> I know, he told me he's upset with us. It was the second time. I took, hey, I, hey, we, yeah, I take full responsibility. <laughs> we, didn't, we didn't come at 8.30, it was on me. That's what I got. This is going to be our third year doing this event with Never Thirst. Um, it's an amazing organization with an amazing cause. Uh, they're bringing clean water to people without. Um, and if you're not aware of this, it's a huge problem in today's world. So glad everybody's here. This is a great call, so let's bow our heads. Lord, thank you so much for this opportunity we have to be here. It's great to have this fitness community come together and try to help the world with the cleaner water. The world that you gave us that was so great. We hope we can take care of it, not just talk about it, but do something about it. This is what we're doing here today. Thank you for everyone here in this great community. In Jesus' name, amen. The average time that these, if you're born a girl, once you turn five years old, your lot in life is to walk to find water for your family. 780 billion hours this year will be dedicated by little girls and women just walking to find dirty water that will make their, themselves and their families sick. You're saving them from being trafficked, you're giving them an education, you're giving them health, you're giving them hope, you're giving them a future. And so when you're working out today, you are, you are literally saving these people's lives. Over the course of our partnership, uh, there's been $35,000 raised just from this event. 40 bucks gives someone clean water. 40 bucks gives someone clean water. Um, the solvable problem. And so the fact that you guys are showing up and contending for these people and so that's like well how i see my job and, and my role in this world is to advocate for them and to tell their stories to you they have no idea that you're going to sweat and be in pain today doing this workout in order for them to have a better future and so on their behalf i just want to say thank you so much and thank you for being here Three, remember you guys can buy shirts on the website register your team through the rest of next week and then you can also make a donation on the mayhem mission site with net proceeds going to benefit the efforts of never thirst throughout the year we got kona ice in the back with snow cones so go back and help yourself tiger's blood's hard to beat right it's the most aggressive sounding one so but ninja cherries is a strong second i think i might go strawberry treasure this one has a question mark on it. Oh, this is a mistake. It's going too quick. Yeah. You gotta get ready to run that hot lap. Decision for me, for sure. Time, yeah. time drop. I don't know. Strawberry and cherry. Because I like quick punch. Uh, okay. <laughs> this is Ninja Cherry. I used to go Tiger's Blood, but... It's free, bro. We're trying them all. You still know how to do this? We'll see. I did a three rep touch and go clean, yeah, clean and jerk the other day because I uh, do it for fresh goes. I hit like 245 touch and go. It's pretty bad though. They just haven't opened up the door to exit yet. We're all real excited. Jeez, so cool. One person is going to start on the biker. The second person is going to get on the bike, which Specialized has brought helmets for everyone that you get to take home with you at the end of the weekend. You're going to take that bike and that helmet, and you are going to ride you're gonna this You're going to look path. both ways when you cross the street. Yes, you're going to look both ways before you cross the street. Safety first. Yeah. Safety first. You guys are going to follow this path that goes around this body of water. You'll come all the way back to where your partner is, and then you guys are going to switch. They're going to do the same thing while you accumulate max meters on the bike herd. It works in groups of four, so we don't have 15, 16 bikes taken off all at once. If you have a watch, you're going to start that watch, and you're going to go for a total of 60 minutes. Up, John. 
I don't know, we're gonna do, what is it, a five mile loop, did you say Thad in there now? Five miles is what I'm gonna do. Probably do that twice, and we talked about riding from here to Dad's. You don't have a bike. Oh. Yep. I'm gonna give you one right, guess who I'm waiting on with the bike. Oh, here we go. My beautiful wife. What's the ETA on, on her? You tell me. 205? We're oh. supposed to be here at 150? Yeah, exactly. I'll give her another 20. Yeah, give her 30 for a minute. Perfect. Easier gear, harder gear. Uh, that'll be enough to make sure that you're getting a decent extension on the leg, yeah. but without too much. I breathe and go a little faster, hit that power button, and it'll keep going. He even brought his, he, he brought his special bike if you want to come his special take a look. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we got to see if you have time. Yeah. yeah, the one that he can go really fast we were in charge so he can keep up. To bring it to him and... And then of he course. takes off without us. Yeah, have to, uh, this is it. Yeah. <laughs> I was supposed Look, to ride right on the back too. He could have a passenger. You have pegs on there? Yeah. Yeah, in the light. Little the seat. reflection lights. because we're going to be out here until dark. I just don't <laughs> know why you just take off without that. It's so yeah. thoughtful. I know. Yeah. I know. And then he just totally disregards us. He takes off realize. without us. We had his back. Uh, we had his back. Type of cool rich thing. Yeah. How's it feel to do the pace car? Pace car? I'm. I'm Excited, a bit nervous. I hope I can keep pace. Hey, where's the roadkill start? Where's the roadkill start? One of the CrossFit games right here. Wait, what? No. Just go around, look yes. around yeah, did pretty good. Just go left, right? Like 35th. Go fast, turn left. Tell <laughs> you the max number of loops around the lake, and then also max meter bike ergs. Don't reset your bikes when you switch off. Just keep it running. Cool. <laughs> Biker park over here. Uh, it's hard. It's hard to hold like zone two pace right now. It's mm -hmm. so, like I want to try and go fast on the bike because that's what I need to work on. When I get here, I'm like, all right, I'm done. Why aren't we moving? We moved enough today. Are you guys partners? You no. two? Me and uh, we did some loops out there. And then Rich and them wanted to get more miles in, so me and Gee did one more lap and. Packed her own in. So is where's Rick? <laughs> Still riding. Then I took the big lap one time. You keep pace with running? Not a shot. Me? Okay. One, I went down pretty hard. You crashed? Yeah, real hard. Sweet. Stephen Street. Be a, we're gonna go through a neighborhood called Capshaw Woods. I'll, I'll, I'll wait get, for you. Get, a, get me to Mayhem. Okay. And then I, well, there's some back roads that we need to go from Mayhem. I don't want you on the main highway, so I'll get you there. Yeah, I don't know about Bailey, but I think I'm gonna take up a uh, professional mountain biking. Yeah. Like Just mountain road natural bike, born talent for it. <laughs> Might uh, join Rich on that home mile race. I mean, you've got like a week after the games yeah. to rest up. So. Easy. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it'll be like recovery. Once you know? we get everything loaded up, you check your email. I sent you the address to seniors. We're gonna get started with the swim workout. It's 3:40 right now. We're going to give everybody till 4.30, 4.40, and we'll get started with the next piece. You can't reach the pedals? Look at this. My legs are really straight. Yeah, you're 5'9", you're 5'2 and a half. You need that much hands on. <laughs> you have to Ohio. You remember the goat carts with the trailer?
What mileage in the game today? Did it? 26. How much is the from the bottom up to here? Uh, it's about six, seven hundred. Nasty. What are you doing for the uh, pond workout? I don't know if I'm doing the pond workout. Let's yeah, see you if, are. <laughs> see if I cramp up and die. If that's what you want, Scott. Makes good TV, I guess. Mm-hmm. I'm here for views. It's hot. That was the worst part. Got at least 20 minutes left. So tired. With how far back you were, we literally like part, close our eyes, and you were right there. How did you climb that so fast? That's all I've been doing, Bailey. That's freaking nuts. He's just biking and climbing that hill. That was fire. Walked faster than I could, rode a bike that hill. You should try. Oh, he just walked. No, I. The first time I ever came here, they had us do this bike loop. I was just walking by and by a nap. I was so excited to chill for 20 minutes, and then this guy pulls up on his bike. And we're like, oh, we'll just wait for Rich. He'll be, he'll be a sec. No. Nope. <laughs> Look up. I was like, is that him? It was. It was him. Oh, nice. You got a frog. Yeah, it's tail. Why, why is it a tail? Because it's a baby. Is it a dog? Is it a dog? Yeah. Vacation. Right, but... He has to be his partner again. Over me. Turn me down. I can't swim. <laughs> He's like five, I mean, where you won't swim. I'm not swimming that. Yeah, exactly. It's very clean. I've seen him throw turtles in there. Snapping turtles. Yeah, but if, as, long as, as long as people. All right, bring it up. <laughs> if you're working out, bring it up. Not you, Haley. All right. So with the total volume that we've done today and throughout the weekend, be smart here. Um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna set 20 minute cap or 20 minute AMRAP. We're going to, we're going to split up into two groups, but it, we're all doing the same workout. Just one group's going to start on the run, one group's going to start on the swim, so we don't have 50 people in the swim at one time. Set up at three, two, one, go. One group, you'll swim this way, come out on this side of the tree, enter on that side, be You're careful. Come up, we'll run, we'll all run the, the loop together to warm up, one. swim and run. Many as you can in 20 minutes. Starting in three, two, 20, 20. one, go! What do you think, Sarge? I think it's going great. It's going you think, great. You thinking about it? I'm thinking about it. Oh, yeah, I'm always thinking about it. Barefoot. I was like, screw it. I did How many did you do? Four in a swim. I uh, I actually felt good on the road too. On this road, I did barefoot. It was like I smooth. Too. Yeah. Well, I've been wearing those barefoot shoes, so yeah. I'm used to running in them. I'm gonna be able to walk tomorrow. What's your strain at? Uh, I think a thousand. What we'll do? We got brisket. We got sides. We got everything. Hang out as long as you guys want to. Get another workout in if you want. The barn's got some equipment. Uh, it's, it's turned into a, um, more of a storage area, but that's kind of where it all started. It was back there in the back of the barn. So if you want to see that, a lot of the earlier videos were in there. But just hang out, have some food, hang, have some fun. Um, in the morning, 8.30, let's go 8.30. We're going to do a Devo kind of podcasty, bring into the storm back. Start with that in the morning. Um, have some fun. Thanks to Specialized. That was awesome. Uh, hope you guys had some... We've never done that before, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, pretty cool, get you guys out. And man, that's the, the thing is like, get out and use your fitness. And you know, everybody gets so caught up in machines and all that type of stuff. I mean, this time of the year, like get out and ride, get out and swim, you know, do, that's why we're fit, trying to be fit is to do stuff outside. So um, glad we could introduce you guys to that a little bit. Uh, man, the more and more you do it, the more and more you get the hang of it, the more and more fun it is. <laughs> This world is not my home. I'm just a passing through. Heaven's not my home.
kind of become a Sunday special. We did something similar-ish yesterday time-wise, but this just works for Sundays. Um, we've got, we'll have three 10-minute AMRAPs. You'll partner up, probably stay with the same partner that you've been with. But instead of yesterday where one person's doing this and this and then you're flip-flopping, nah, you're all by yourself this time. My How's legs. Your, uh, your body messed up today? Uh, just this right quad where I shoved a handlebar through it. When you crash? Is it on the, you haven't looked at the GoPro yet. I don't like that. It's a good one. Feels like I tried to dry needle my quad with my handlebar. Yeah, we don't know where we want to start. We don't know which one to do first. We're about to start and neither of us have done a shouldered overhead or a rope climb, so we're like, maybe we should start somewhere else. <laughs> maybe the sled push one. It's like a warm up. You could like warm up one. Get the How many the hours have you been here? Other? You haven't done any warm up? Three. <laughs> I didn't copy. Oh, yeah. That's all you need. Yeah, stations as the boys. I'm Paige Power. <laughs> Get out of my way and Paige Power. <laughs> Ride a Bronco. <laughs> Drive one too. I'm the real Paige Power, so I can confirm this message. <laughs> Product weight. Final answer? Can be. 100? We going prices right here? 103. It's right there. Nice. 103 pounds. Standard rogue push sled. Dog sled. How much? We should have used at semifinals 2023. How much did your sled weigh? Six million. Which one? This one? No, the carpet. Uh, TBD, the variable. They just put an X. 16 ounces. Did we do hand over hand? No. Nope. Was that in the workout description? Yep. You're allowed to heave out. Okay. Five pounds. Oh, she does. She's right at 45 pounds. She's like 43. But these are high temps, so they're like 43. Okay. Ow. We already went over the gentleman's agreement. Nobody runs back to the rope. That's good. So we're clear. Breathing through a straw. Shoes on their car to dry out. Yeah, that's fair. You'll help us put everything up boxes, barbells, sleds, ropes. We'll go ahead, grab a group picture, we'll do a closeout, we'll do autographs, everything like that. And then you guys will be able to swim out of here. I apologize to whoever left their shoes on top of their car to try to dry them out for the pond, because they have now been washed. Rain and the the uh, ratchet, whatever. We appreciate you guys. Glad to have you part of the group, part of the family now. Uh, thank you for all that you guys do in supporting us and being part of our community. Hope you guys come back and see us. Um, what we'll do now is we'll make a line. We'll make a line in front of the rig. We'll take some pictures. And then uh, I'll get under the M. Sarge will have a phone, have somebody behind you. Take your picture, pass it on. And we'll knock out some pictures. And then anything you want signed, let's put on that table. And I'll run over there and sign it. So whatever you guys got, that's what we're here for. That's why we wait throughout the weekend to take pictures so we can get all that done and have fun throughout the weekend and do the pictures last. So we appreciate you guys. Let's get a picture and some more pictures.